What's up you guys? Today is Motivational Monday. You know, with my channel, for me, it's not just like, oh, a YouTube channel that you can just come to for hair tutorials or whatever. Even though it looks that way. But for me, I feel like it's a journey. Like, I've been on YouTube for about maybe six years. So, I feel like I kind of grew up on here. Well, I'm gonna say transformed into my womanhood. It's like, y'all have been on my journey with me. Y'all have seen so many different changes. And I'm gonna just let y'all know, I'm literally, literally a butterfly right now. Started off as a caterpillar, worked my way into a cocoon and back out again. And here I am. I must say that right now, I'm still morphing. I'm still becoming who I am. I'm still learning more about myself daily. So I guess this video is just gonna be me talking about um, myself. And I wanna talk about myself because I want y'all to know that I'm not just talking at y'all. You know, I'm not in a position to where I can say, y'all need to do this or y'all need to do that because I'm learning myself. and. I got so much positive feedback from my last video on learning to embrace where you are right now, learning to be positive no matter where you are, and realizing that as long as you recognize where you are, where you went wrong, and where you could possibly be, and if there's room for change, there's always room for hope. I don't know about y'all, but I know for me, when I'm working out or when I'm cleaning up, that's when my mind is like gone. I'm either analyzing my life, thinking about things good and bad, I'm sorting out my thoughts, and I'm just trying to remind myself of who I am. Planning out stuff, you know, what my goals are, what do I want to do in life, things that made me sad, things that could possibly make me happy, what can I do to change my situations, how can I continue to grow, how can I be a blessing to someone else. Like, I think about so much stuff, you know, and I know who I am, I know my worth, but it's something about today that I just, man, I just felt like I can do anything I set my heart to and do it all while being me. As long as I've been on YouTube, I have always tried to be as transparent as I could possibly be. For one, to be unique and be themselves is a beautiful thing. I just don't believe that God created us to be the same. I don't believe that God created us to be just like anyone else around us. Even when you have some similarities, there is always gonna be something a little bit different from the person next to you. I remember when I was younger, I used to think that I was so weird. I always thought I was strange. I always thought I was misunderstood. And unlike most people, I was ashamed of that. As I grew older, I realized that the weirdness or the strangeness about me, the levels to who I am, it's not a bad thing. Like, I love who I am. You know, and when I say this, I don't mean like, I love my ways or anything like that because sometimes I can have good ways and I can have bad ways depending on the situation or what I'm going through at the moment but me as a person I am so blessed and thankful for the mindset that I have the way that I question things the way that you know I love people the way that I carry myself even in my imperfections that I'm beautiful that I am made perfect the way that I am and I can say that for a long time for a very long time I focus so much on the idea of being able to stand your ground everything about your being as a person whether you're goofy whether you're boring whether you're serious whether you're you know whatever kind of personality you have one of the things that I've always believed in is for a person to truly be able to be themselves and remove any mask they may have. I'm not talking about a physical mask, of course, but it's more of a mental thing where every person you've been around throughout your lifetime, you pick up a little bit of who they are and then you move on from that person to the next person and you pick up a little bit of who they are 
and basically it's like your whole life by the time you realize it you've picked up so many different personalities so many different you know likes and dislikes that had nothing to do with you from the jump taking a step back from everything you thought you wore and sorting out what is you and what is not you this is a part of you that people get to know and fall in love with there's this quote out there and i don't know why i always try to quote it and i never know it verbatim like for some reason i just i always forget but anyways i'm assuming it goes something like she was blue and he was blue because she pretended to be another color and he pretended to be another color they walked right past one another and never recognized each other and when I read that it was just like wow you know just the it was a short statement but it was so powerful within itself what I took from that is if you're weird and awkward and you're somewhat ashamed of who you are you feel like people aren't gonna like you for who you are so this person over here you got these two people <laughs> this person over here is weird and awkward as well but they too have been ashamed of who they are so they kind of like hide who they are well guess what your whole life you're around people that probably don't even know who the real you and probably wouldn't even like the real you or probably would like the real you but the fact is is that they never get to truly know you because you feel like you have to be a certain way in order to please them or in order for them to like you so the person who is just like you can never know that oh wow there's someone just like me someone just as awkward someone who's just as clumsy just as goofy silly serious um, emotional whatever it is that you are as a person these people miss you because you both are or you all are pretending to be someone else no matter what, be yourself. Be as transparent as you can with people because you never know who is out there just like you, who thinks just like you, who approves of you. And it's a beautiful thing when you have so many people surrounding you, but it's even more beautiful when you have people surrounding you for you, loving you for who you are. They may not agree with everything about you, but they love and appreciate every single thing about you. I just want to encourage y'all to be yourselves. So, yeah, I'm finna get ready to go. These kids are out here about to start playing. It's getting dark. As y'all can see, I'm getting dark. So, <laughs> I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching, and y'all be blessed.